Ciao Michi, hello, bonjour à tous, welcome back on my channel. I hope you're doing great. So I'm going to film this nice makeup look that I created for you guys. It's a makeup look for Valentine's Day, as you can see from the shirt and from the lipstick. I wanted to create something as sexy. So it's a soft, smoky eye that you can recreate, of course. You're probably gonna be tired of seeing me with red lipsticks, but that's my signature and then also that's a color that I love. But I decided to go with an oldie but a goodie, um, a sophisticated red lipstick to celebrate Valentine's Day with you guys with this really nice color from Dior, which is their classic red. If you love red lipstick, this is definitely a color that you need in your collection because I find it's the perfect red. It stays long and it elevates the look as you can see because before uh, putting the lipstick, the makeup look, I found it was missing a little something. And then as soon as I put the red lipstick, it changed the whole makeup look. So if you are excited as I am to see how I create this makeup, Look, then keep on watching. Mwah. The first step is to take a really light color, which is the golden orchid, and to put it in the crease just to add a little bit of dimension and i've already uh, primed my eyes by the way if you're wondering so you see it adds a bit of dimension once this is done i'm going with a color so the burn orange uh that is literally at the bottom of the first color that i use so it has a little bit of orange uh color and i'm going to use it for or actually instead of this i'm gonna go raw sienna because i found that it has a little bit less orange it has more uh, neutral and more brown so that's the one that i'm gonna use um same place so in the corner because we're gonna do kind of a smoky eye so we want to make sure that the crease is really blended and defined uh, as well so make sure you blend 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 like this here so you see it's getting it's getting there slowly okay so the next step um it's actually going to be a transition step i'm going to uh, use the love letter uh, color which is this one on top here and put it all over the crease but i'm going to go with the, the brown color after so this is kind of a transition color so i'm taking just a bit because those colors are really pigmented and putting it on top slowly and kind of building it up and I'm going to make sure that I blend the color so I really like this kind of brownish color uh, literally at the side of it so this color here antique uh, bronze and I'm going on top so what I'm going to do I'm going to pat it on top of the color that I just picked just to add a little bit of smoked out effect but not too much because I really I still want to keep the um, pink underneath if it makes sense Here you go. So I'm using a angled brush here. I'm going to take the brownish color, which is called Cypress Umber here, and kind of draw a wing liner just to identify the look a little bit so that the look looks a little bit more sexy because this is what we want. Here you can use uh, any brush. So this one, it's kind of a flat brush, but not too flat uh, either because you want to use it to smoke out the corner so just to smoke out a little bit so it doesn't look like a really harsh line it's getting there it's getting there <laughs> 
and just blend a bit so that it's all smoked out and I'm using brown but if you want you can go with a black uh, liner as well if you want something that shows a little bit more what I'm gonna do I'm just going to sharp this eyeliner because I feel that it's not sharped enough and I feel it kind of gives me a droopy eye so I'm going to sharp it same thing here And I think I had a little bit of fallout as well. Okay, so once the base is done, we're going to do the face. And after, we're going to fix because we're missing a little bit of eyeshadow underneath. But I'm going to do it off camera because you've probably seen so many times how to apply foundation. So I'm going to apply my foundation, a little bit of blush, a little bit of highlight and bronzer. And after, we'll continue with the I am back and I did my brows. I also did uh, the foundation, the highlight. I bronzed. And I highlight a lot because it's a kind of a holiday so I want to make sure that I was glowy and sharp <laughs> so uh, now I'm back I put a little bit of mascara and you see how it makes such a difference just by applying the eyeshadow at the bottom of your eyes I'm going to do a trick that my friend uh, taught me on the other video which was to use a light color and draw kind of a line underneath you see how it brights the under eye and just blend it a bit so that it opens the look as you can see you can leave it as it is um, but I'm going to use the Primavera color so this one here and just to put it uh, in the middle to add a pop of something so you see how it makes such a different look at look at both eyes it's crazy so just by putting in the middle it kind of softened the look but adds a little pop of something and of course it's valentine's day you can use a nude lip but even no valentine's day i always go with a red lipstick and that's what i'm gonna do today so i am going to use a fancy red lipstick just to celebrate a valentine's uh, with you guys so it's the dior rouge and it's color 999 so it's basically their uh, red signature i'm using the regular one but they also have the matte one that you can use if you want something a little bit more matte but let me go with the um, regular one so just to add wow look at this color wow look how it changes the whole look i kind of forgot i had this lipstick and i found it such it gives it's so like luxurious i feel even if you go with a a regular eyeliner and then you pop this red lipstick it looks so sophisticated i really love this color i kind of forgot that i had it but now <laughs> i think i'm gonna use it every day so let me fix a bit There's nothing like Dior lipstick, honestly. Mm. I love, love, love this color. And now let me, so I don't laugh and I have lipstick on my teeth. Here you go. Mm. What a nice color. The red lipstick is literally the diva of this makeup look so this is the end of my video guys i really hope that you enjoy it happy valentine's day to you you're gonna have a wonderful valentine's day you can do a souper aux chandelles at your place with your valentine if not you can invite your friend and do souper aux chandelles with your friend as well if you don't have a loved one you can definitely celebrate with your friends with your family and have how special is this to have a special day for all the couples out there? 
you still need to do your part all year long but it's really nice to have one day for all the couples so that you can celebrate and show the love that you have for the other one i really hope that you like this makeup look that you got inspired and that you will be able to create for valentine's day so take care of yourself take care of your family and i will